Hello everybody and welcome back to brand new Dead Overflow video. This video will be talking about how a lot of websites are down. And I mean a lot because Cloudflare is down as well. So let's actually kind of kind of maybe see what is the root cause behind this and maybe understand what went wrong and where and how many websites are actually affected by this. I found a few and actually you'll be surprised to see how many of them are just being affected by it. And you might have seen that they're desperately trying to reload and actually reconfigure themselves so that so that they are accessible to you. As you can see what just happened now, but it cannot be because Cloudflare is officially down as of now. So let's go with the video. And before we get started, make sure to subscribe. We're trying to hit 100k by the end of the year. Also, check out all of my three courses. Links are in the description. Now let's go with the video. So currently, if you try to load ChatGPT, you would not be able to because it will tell you, please unblock challenges cloudflare.com to proceed. And that struck me as a little strange. So Tailwind itself, like this library and many more libraries are broken due to internal server error. Therefore, any website which uses Tailwind, I believe like Aveno, will be broken. So a lot of websites which use Tailwind are broken because of this. Besides that, Udemy is not working. As you can see, it still says us, tells us the same message. Challenges.cloudflare.com are blocked. It is blocked. Uh, Canva.com, same message. Literally, it is the exact same problem. Coinbase, same message. And even here, DoorDash. So you cannot order your food anymore. That's actually pretty, <laughs> that's actually pretty weird. But the fact that the most like a lot of these libraries, like Tailwind, are broken means that a lot of websites will be broken because of that. And uh, I actually saw that itself challenges that Cloudflare doesn't work. So what I did is I opened up Inspect Element to check the console for errors. And a lot of stuff is wrong, but there is this uh, access to script. This from origin has been blocked by course policy, no access control. So something is something definitely has happened. And if we refresh the page, you can see that it tries to load a script called challenges.cloudflare. But first of all, there is no access control allow origin pre header present. So it's iframing literally uh, a, a domain which doesn't have that header present, meaning it's going to probably fail. But on top of that, we also see 500 internal server error meaning that this is wrong and it's down and a lot of websites are because of that affected and we can obviously see that so tailwind is one of the scripts which i was able to find honestly tried to make a video on something and i realized the tailwind was down and i'm like hmm, why would that be i went to chat gpt to maybe ask what's going on but i was met with the same message therefore my eyebrows were a little bit raised and from the post on the reddit slash cloudflare we can see that people are noticing just two hours ago that this is happening and they have noticed that a lot of sites are not working due to cloudflare the website says uh, under maintenance uh, wonder if something went wrong even down detectors having issues uh, i believe it's just going to be resolved very soon because this is a very big outage now one of the things which i actually found interesting is when i tried to load for example this website it will tell me that this budapest server is down which is interesting so i'm like maybe someone from america or united states or somewhere else in the world like asia could still access this website but just because i'm like this is the closest like relay to me maybe that's why it's wrong so i went to proxy browser and uh i went to first one and oh wow vienna so same error uh okay second browser okay budapest as well so okay third proxy browser okay so everything is down even the fourth proxy browser is down so this just proves my point that a lot of websites are down because of this uh i don't know if this actually is a proxy browser nope it's not uh block away advanced proxy site oh would you look at that it's also down what i also wanted to see uh, is how many scripts are just literally down so let's maybe research that this is hideme.proxy so this works okay so it's not using cloudflare so any website which doesn't use cloudflare or any of the libraries which are affected by this outage are many pretty much fine but let's actually see which scripts aren't working well the thing about it most websites will probably download these scripts and keep them like locally for especially if it's css because there's not many updates that are going to that you know they can enforce many updates but i want to what i want to check right now is animate.js maybe or uh how is it called font awesome seems to be working fine so that's good uh, what else can we search for to see whether it works dude while I was researching, I just found this crazy anime.js library, 
which look at this this is like an airplane engine what in the actual hell this looks clean holy smokes this looks clean okay i'm gonna actually do some research on this and maybe use it for my future websites because what in the actual hell is good looking but this looks clean so the point of this video is to raise awareness just so you understand why your chat gpt or why any of these websites aren't even working it's because cloudflare is down and hopefully this will soon be patched thank you so much for watching this video make sure to subscribe comment down below stay safe stay responsible and as always Peace.